In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My dear friends, let's begin this new week in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. In today's gospel, we see Jesus beginning his public ministry. The Lord begins with the formula of John the Baptist, the same ministry of repentance and forgiveness. The Lord begins to preach, repent and believe in the gospel. Though the Lord chose the method of John the Baptist, there is also a unique new feature in the ministry of Jesus. Along with the preaching, the Lord also accompanied it with the healing. Very many diseases, those are demoniacs and those who are in need of the Lord's touch were healed. And that was the uniqueness of the mission of Jesus. And that's how he brought about the reign of kingdom of God. My dear friends, as we follow in the footsteps of Jesus, we are called to continue the mission of Jesus in whatever work and whatever way that we can, we it is possible in our hands and in our might to bring about a world of brotherhood, fellowship and peace. Therefore, let us pray for the grace that after the example of Jesus, we may spend ourselves through our own little ways in serving and helping others to realize the love and healing of God. All that I am, all that I have, I lay them down before you, O Lord. All of my regrets, all my acclaim, the joy and the pain, I'm making them yours. Lord, I offer my life to you, everything I've been through. Use it for your glory, Lord, I offer my days to you, lifting my praise to you as a pleasing sacrifice. Lord, I offer you my life. Things in the past, things yet unseen, wishes and dreams that are yet to come true. All of my hopes, all of my plans, my heart and my hands are lifted to you. Lord, I offer my life to you, everything I've been through. Use it for your glory, Lord, I offer my days to you, lifting my praise to you. As a pleasing sacrifice, Lord, I offer you my life. Jesus, we praise and thank you for the ministry of healing and sanctification through which your church continues even today. Therefore, we ask for your minister, the healing touch of your hands to be upon them so that they may bind the injury of the people, dispense your forgiveness and love. We also pray for all those who are involved in the ministry of preaching your word that they may preach not only with their words but also through their lives. We make this prayer in your holy name to your Lord. Amen. My dear friends, may this day be a day of making known Christ to others and towards this may the Lord bless us, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.